So here's the, the pedal arrangement with the magnetic gears and it's three to one ratio. One turn of this makes uh, three turns of this and this is the uh, air compressor that uh, maybe is oversized but I hope and it's channeled to the uh, 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 generator uh, with air going to the, uh, the blades. So I'm going to start it. Let's see if it works. I'm using my hands rather than feet because it's uh, easier here. Hey, it's not turning. Uh-oh. Well, there's air coming out of it, but not very strong. Oh, man, there there's must be too much leaking. Uh, the blades, you know, uh, the, the tolerances are, are not uh, good. Well, well, it doesn't take much to make this turn, but it takes something, you know. It looks like a pedaled air compressor. Maybe somebody else can make it better. Won't work. Okay, I found out how to levitate the entire apparatus. I have a ring magnet on the bottom. And then you can have six or eight, more than three or four. And it spins completely, completely freely. Which it doesn't when it's like the other one on, on uh, ball bearings. Now, this is an example. When you're building an apparatus, you're going to have more stuff here, like all the coils, you know, the other magnets and so on, right? So this is about a pound, and here's about five pounds, and 10 pounds, and 20 pounds.